Do you wanna hear about how the real world's a place for me? There's nothing out there won't look better on a TV screen. There's a better way, and I don't care what you say. I just wanna play. We all just wanna play. Things will be alright as soon as I get back to school. Good morning, Kettleron. Today is Tuesday, September 25th. I'm Garrett Heiston. On October 13th, there's a domestic abuse awareness event taking place at Liberty. Let's go to the video for more information. A kid just like anybody else sits in a class. He appears just like all the other kids, but he's not. His mind is not in the classroom and not in the school. His mind is on the words that happened last night between his mom and his dad. Emotional abuse. Domestic violence affects 20 people every minute in this country. It doesn't stop at the people affected. It is like a virus of pain. It spreads and then the children are affected with the pain. Three to four million children a year are exposed to domestic violence. Trauma changes children. However, you can help. On October 13th from 12 to 4, come to Liberty High School to empower yourself with knowledge. Together, we, we can shatter the silence and stop domestic violence. Remember, the event takes place on October 13th. There are several college visits coming up. Seniors, make sure you stop by Guidance to sign up if you are interested in any of these. Also, remember that college night is at Lord Fairfax tonight from 6 to 8. 75 schools will be there. Reporter Madison Slevin joins us now with the week's episode of College Tour Tuesday. Thanks, Carly. I'm Madison Slevin, and welcome back to College Tour Tuesday. Today we're taking a look at the University of Lynchburg through the eyes of 2017 graduate Taylor Havlu. Hi guys, I'm Taylor Havlu and I graduated from Kettle Run in 2017. I go to the University of Lynchburg now and I'm an exercise physiology major. The point of this video is to give you guys a little virtual tour of the campus and, should, and to show you what I do on an everyday basis. And in here is where I live with my roommate Cassidy. Uh, we live in here which is technically a freshman dorm but this year they made it into a freshman through senior housing because they're tearing down the main upperclassmen housing on campus right across from the soccer field. And here is Tate, which is where we live. And over there is Montgomery Hall, which houses only freshmen. And here is Friendship Circle. And I'm standing right on Friendship Circle, which is the center of campus. And don't step on it until after you graduate or else you will not graduate on time. And here's Drysdale Student Center. And this is where the campus bookstore is right here. And over here is the gym area where you can go and work out. They have a bunch of weights and treadmills and stuff. And down this hall is where we eat most of our meals. It's our um, dining hall. It's called the Westover Room. And lastly, one of the activities that we like to do on campus is go to a lot of soccer games. Uh, here's a video of the boys playing soccer the other night. It's really fun to go to with your friends because everybody sits on the track and cheers on the teams that are playing that night. I hope you guys enjoyed that video of what it's like here on campus and have a great rest of your school year and good luck to all the seniors applying to college. Thanks Taylor, now back to you on the set. Thanks Madison, now for club news and sports with Garrett Heiston. Thanks Garrett, Interact Club will meet after school today until 3.30. Members will work on cornhole for a goal. Those of members who want to go to the state fair, make sure you get a permission slip from Miss Rudolph. Dues, fair fees, and the permission slip are due tomorrow. Psychology Club will meet after school on Thursday in room 291. All are welcome. <laughs> Freshman SCA will meet after school on Thursday in room 428. Please see Miss Reffitt if you cannot attend. Now for a look at the weather with Garrett Heisen. Thanks, Garrett. Today's weather will be a 70% chance of rain, scattered thunderstorms with a high of 80 and a low of 67. Back to you on the set. Thanks, Garrett. Have a great day. We leave you with a look at the birthdays and the lunch menu.